hi hello everyone i love you all guys because you are so smart and excellent students okay today all of you i want you to prepare your notebook and your pencil because today's lesson is very interesting okay now let's see how countable nouns are different from uncountable nouns let's read together a car an egg a melon a ruler so can we count these nouns yes we can a car an egg if we say two cars can we say two cars? Yes, we can. Can we say two eggs? Yes, we can. Can we say four rulers? Yes, we can. Let's take a look here. Two cars. Don't forget that two is plural. We can say two car. No. Two cars. Don't forget to add S. Okay, guys? Three rulers and let's take a look on the sentence here i'd like a melon i'd like a melon here i'd i'd this is the short form of i would like instead of saying i would like let's make it quickly in rapid connected speech people usually say I'd 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 like a melon I'd like a melon if you look at the sense if you find it like this say it I'd if you find it like this say it I would like a melon so the I'd here is the short form of I would like uncountable nouns uncountable nouns things we can count like what like water like sugar and salt can we count water like one water two water three water no we can't count water but we can say some water some sugar some salt okay guys Let's take a look on the sentence. I'd like some sugar. I'd like some sugar. I'd like some sugar. Okay, let's write another sentence. I'd like some water. Okay, guys, I would like some water. So we use some with uncountable nouns. And we also use some with countable nouns. Okay, guys, here, unit eight, I'd like a melon. Let's see the vocabulary together and let's enjoy the video okay pasta the first word here it's pasta do you like pasta i like pasta with meatballs meatballs yeah i like pasta in arabic they say macarona so in english we say pasta pasta okay the second word is bread 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 all the kids like cereal 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 don't forget that meat here we got e and a they make long e here lemon lemon I can count lemon like one lemon, two lemons, three lemons, 
an onion, an onion. Cucumber, cucumber, cucumber. I like cucumber. Some people may say cucumber, cucumber, without pronouncing er at the end of the word. This is called British English, not American English. So, cucumber, it's okay. If you say cucumber, it's okay too. Melon, melon, melon. Now let's see the video together and listen to Onion. the vocabulary. Onion. Lemon. 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 Bread. Bread. Melon. Melon. Cereal. Cereal. Cucumber. Cucumber. Meat. Meat. Countable nouns. Now let's talk about singular and plural. Okay, guys. Singular means one thing. Okay, like a cat. But here we add a, not an. Why? Because the first letter here in the word cat is a consonant. It's not a vowel. Okay, guys. Here's the word an orange. An orange. The word here starts with o. Wait a minute. I add an with any word start with a vowel okay guys but it's singular okay guys it's singular and orange o here is a vowel see the vowels a e i o and u and all other sounds or all other letters are consonant except a e i o and u see the plural okay I can use some with plural things or plural nouns. Yes, I can use some here. Some cats. Some orange. Two cats. Two orange. They are countable things or they are countable nouns. Countable nouns don't have a plural form. Okay? We can't say two water, two bread. To, to salt, to sugar. No, we can. So, it doesn't have a plural form. And also, they are amounts of things such as food and drinks. Let's see now how they don't have a plural form. The word rice here. Rice, rice, rice. Countable or uncountable? Guys, it's uncountable. So, I would like some rice. Some rice. Some fruits. Amounts. Okay? They are amounts of things. Such as food and fruits. Or maybe drink. Like here, water. Like here, the word water, some water. There is no plural form for water. Like one water, two water, no. Some water, okay guys? Some fruit, some rice. But guys, notice that some foods can be countable and uncountable. How? How some food can be countable and and the same time can be uncountable. Okay, let's see. Some melon. Some melon. Okay, guys. Some melon. This is some melon. A melon. Here, some melon is uncountable. A melon here is countable. 
I can count it. A melon, two melons, three melons, four melons. Okay, guys? Some ice cream. Some ice cream. And ice cream here is countable. And here is the word some ice cream. The ice cream here is uncountable. I mean the ice cream here. I don't mean this. I mean the ice cream. And ice cream. All of it, I can count it. Okay, guys, I can count it. Like one ice cream, two ice creams, four ice creams. Okay, if I mean this one, I don't mean ice cream. Okay, guys. Here the word water. It's uncountable. Okay, but I can make it countable if I say a cup of water, a bottle of water. I can I can count a bottle of water, two bottles of water, three bottles of water, four bottles of water, a can of Pepsi, a can of Pepsi. Okay, guys. Some people of us may say cans that's wrong guys a can of pepsi not cans for primary three b okay guys it's time for dictation now listen carefully and write with me i'd like a banana full stop I don't like apples.